we're looking into the future a little bit here. A few years from now. Clara has stopped by. Grants. Little room, little cubicle, whatever you want to call it, in hell on earth. She doesn't have to change his diaper. He's got one arm left. He can still get to that bathroom, especially with his skateboard. Yeah. Remember, they have the cup-shaped diapers for the torsos, as they are in decades of Wish for Death Pain. Yeah, they have other Wish for Death Pain but besides torsos, but it makes for a good video. When you go against those at the top, they play me and think long term. Anyway, as he's there, she notices Grant's nose looks a little funny. And she asks, Did that happen here? And Grant's mother says, Oh no, that was a garage door. And Grant's dad says, oh yeah, when Grant was very little, he was kind of clumsy and ran into a garage door, and that just sets Grant off. He gestures with that one arm and points and, and says, Dad, cusses him out, says, Dad, you told me that garage door had an electric eye. Yeah, it's not Grant talking. They use those uh, street chemicals in hell on earth. Makes them a little angrier, a little more on edge. That way the witnesses don't have to feel bad about what they're witnessing. They're angry. For all those on the streets, work on the unseen business, work in the unseen business, remember to tell your kids the truth about that. And remember when my victim leads off when you call 424-229-0911 can't reach me and don't know if your phone will not be allowed to work when your family's in a burning building. Certify that mail to me. Show where that very dangerous censorship comes from. Back to my little hell on earth story here. Torso human. Tell your kids the truth about the streets. Teach your kids about the streets, or the streets will teach your kids. I'm John Membrady. Got any good Hell on Earth stories? Oh, nuns have the best Hell on Earth stories. Come tell me.